hits them at the right angle. He's gonna blind me. <laughs> what can I do for you, my bra? I'm on an important mission. Searching for a way back home. Oh, la -di da You even got one of those fancy accents, Nocha. Hey, Pete, this Okir is more on an important mission. Says he's trying to find his way home. Sorry, bro. I can't help you with any of that. See, this is for mongrels only. The last holdout. The one place that mongrels can be free. You could be a fly spy trying to get our slingshot. You're hiding one of those worms under all that hair. Should I give back a bit of sass? This place looks pretty fucking worm-eaten to me. We well, see some nasty things around here. But nothing as nasty as what you fly spies cuddle up with at night. I'm not a spy. That's what a spy would say, hey? I think I saw your head twitching a bit, but you should get that looked at by one of your flayed doctors. I promise you can trust me. How can I prove I'm not a spy? Tell you what, if you bring me one of those flay worms, a live one, I'll let you in. I know you spaghetti heads would never give up one of your precious parasites. Until I see one of those little squirmy bastards staying on the side of the bridge. So that is what this is for. Freak, you actually did it. Hey, hey, bitch, it can't die it. I didn't think you'd actually get one. Uh, they look dead even when they're twitching, hey? But it is twitching. That's clearly alive. Yeah, you're right. I've only seen one of them when they're inside one of those flay skulls. And that's usually when the skulls are in pieces under my boot. Ozia! I want to ask you about that slingshot you mentioned. Why are you so interested in it, huh? It's not going anywhere, bro. Once you're inside, go talk to Commander Swart. Pit, part of the bry. Tonight, we're gonna eat something fresh. They're gonna eat it? The thing that smells like old socks because it's dead and rotting? Oh, that's nasty. Past the guards? Speak! I brought the guard a bristle worm and he let me in. I'm going to have those morons killed. You seem harmless enough, too soft to be dangerous, but you do have the stink of the flay ash on you. I'll be keeping an eye on you. Ah, so you really don't like the flay? Those worm headed bastards were pilfering our children for their parasites for years. Inbred swans can't even have kids of their own. They come out looking like smashed up maggots. Extra limbs, no eyes. So, they come for hours. Took the pregnant women. Stole crying babies from their cradles. Let those parasites crawl into them and take over. The slingshot here keeps the flay out. Vibrations inside it makes their worms go mad, start burrowing deeper into them. Eventually, turns their brains into soup. They think we were once the same people. How far they have fallen. The flay and the mongrels were once part of the same tribe. Years ago, yeah? We mongrels are descendants of those who fled to slag from Bars during the Agnate Wars. A mongrel child found an egg buried in the lava fields. The parasite inside was the first of the flay. Their numbers increased, infecting us, spreading. When they started taking babies, we ran. This base was a Bars refugee outpost. The statue there was dragged from the Bars city gates. We found a slingshot in an old agnate base and brought it here where it keeps the fly away from us. We heard its vibrations have even reached their metal city, stopping them from spreading out. I'm sorry your people went through all of that. 
The slingshot is very important to you. Yeah, but it is failing. Every day the signal is weaker. Every day the signal is weaker. It's failing. We're tired. We don't want to run anymore. We're looking for a more permanent solution. What sort of solution? A weapon in the lost city of past. Our ancestors were building a weapon to deal a final blow to the Agnates. Find us that weapon, let us destroy the flay, and we will not need the slingshot anymore. I think I'm actually going to help them. I mean, they are clearly in the right here and the Flay are clearly in the wrong. Literally burrowing into children's minds and taking over their bodies and kidnapping children and mothers. Yeah, I'm going to help them. Fuck the Flay. So you want me to find an ancient city and commandeer a lost super weapon? And time is wasting. Good luck. Close to being operational. Oh yeah, they're fixing it up. Is it really close to being operational? I don't know, it looks really rusty, but I guess rust won't necessarily keep it from flying. All the structures in Mongol territory seem to have a layer of grime and rust on them. There's the skeletons. Skeletons just chilling all over the place. Hanging out there, hanging out there, enjoying the sun, getting a tan on their bones. I don't like it in here, Mark. Same pooch. Cast iron rusted panel bearing the engraved names of mongrel founding fathers. Those must also be backers. Copy coordinates. This is the uh, statue that they said they took from Boss, right? Is this the coordinates to Boss? Long list of glyphs makes up the warden exit coordinates of boss. Where would I input this sort of thing? Or can I just use it on a warden and that'd be good enough? Looks like this place is sinking. The bronze tableau shows a group of soldiers laying down their lives as they protect a central figure wearing a scientist's lab coat. The water of the lake is thick, sluggish, and tinged with green. There's no way across the dilapidated bridge. This place is sprawling. Clumps of mangroves sway slightly in the sulfurous air. Like, where have I been? Where have I not been? I mean, I know I haven't been here, but like, where does this link up with places I've been? Been... here? Yes? No, that's the main platform. That's like right where we came in. No way across the dilapidated bridge. We already saw that description. Okay, I think that's it. Soldiers die, and all they get is a statue. 
aside from this panel. I think I can access this terminal. Slingshot device secured containment field active. I'm guessing if we wanted to, we could probably sabotage the slingshot device or something like that. Let's head to a race site one. Wait, what are these? Flay. Why are there two locations? Ah, oh, right. Flay and then Charnel House, which we just discovered. Lots of sulfur in the atmosphere. The rusted spire has been stripped of all valuable parts. It's in low power mode. The large, oddly shaped stones cast dark shadows over the heat baked earth. The walls battered, but still standing strong. All these hard to reach corners like here. I feel like there must be stuff here, but it doesn't seem to be. Where's my secrets? Where's my gold nuggets? Not that there's anything to buy. fortified wall has stood firm against an ancient onslaught. The building has been reduced to rubble. Just the skeleton of the building remains. Looks like this is probably a greenhouse. It's got the right shape for it. It's got like vents, I think, as well. There's my secrets. Ooh, also not gold. So again, must be important for a quest. This handy detonator could be used to trigger an explosive device. Uh, we don't... I have an explosive unless a fuel cell counts. Oh! Okay. This shell could probably go off pretty easily. I'll keep it at the bottom of my rucksack and hope it doesn't explode. <laughs> Wonder what I'm going to be blowing. Up. I think that's it for here. Yeah. Alright, let's see if I can just use the coordinates on the warden, if that will get me to boss. Didn't seem to work. I think I should scan these things, like the egg and this, and especially the glyphs. I think I should scan them at the console. I think I already scanned that.
Ah, oh, nothing? Dang. I was really thinking that would add it to my map or something. Nothing about the cantaloupe. I think that was all the new stuff. Yeah. A mock at night. The night of the storm. The night when it wasn't what you think. I mean, it was. I was drunk. I needed help. But there was more. Are you sure you want to go opening those wounds right now? I know, Marky, I know. I don't want to cause you more pain, but I want you to know that I, I spoke to Charlize just before you came. I was in a dark place. I was going to end it all. I was making one last phone call. I wanted to talk to you, but she picked up. I told her to tell you that I loved you and that I was sorry. She phoned Freddy right after, told him to look after me, that you would come and get me. I was so alone, Mark. Everybody was gone. Everybody left me. Everyone but you and Charlize. What are you looking for? Forgiveness? No, I don't think that I can ever be forgiven. I just want you to know that I am trying. That I want to be a better man for you, for her. Whether you want forgiveness or not, you don't need it, Don. It wasn't your fault. Thank you, my brother. I'm not exactly sure what to do now, but I think we can probably talk to, was it Adam? The uh, Flay at the uh, Witherberg Bar, and I think I can also talk to the uh, mongrel that was fishing right next to here. Ah, that smells good. Hey, good looking. <clears throat> can I, can I buy you a drink? Oh no, can you buy me a drink? <laughs> I'll, I'll, you know. Atum, the Grand Bar sent me. What the, f what the fuck? We don't have much time. This host has regained control. The host is regaining control. Good. I want the host to have their life back. Uh, well, in that case, in that case, quick, tell me everything you know about boss. Yes, the Grand War requires the boss weapon. We can use it to destroy the mongrel slingshot. The slingshot is old technology. Its vibrations are the source of the foul brood. The road to pass is dangerous and very long. The warden in Kirin has been disconnected, but I have found a way to add it back to the network. I have found a nexus. What's a nexus? What does it have to do with the wardens? A, a nexus controls the entry and exit points of a warden. Using a warden, you will be able to instantly travel to the boss homeland in Kirin. I have both the location and the coordinates of the nexus. The Hanging Nexus is, is in Zozo. He is taking back control. Coordinates are at one. I'm going to be sick. Why are you looking at it? <laughs> that is so gross. They just throw up inside of their helmet. Ugh. Okay, so that's where we put the coordinates that we found into the thing that can actually change where the warden takes us. Yinzozo. 
Let's go speak with the mongrel now. Give egg. Oh, that's what we're doing. So that they can have another bug. Oh. Is this... Is this for me? I thought you might want to head out hunting again. With a partner. I don't have anything to pay you with. No, nothing that could be worth this. Just look after it when it hatches. Go on some good adventures. Yes, like. Th thank you. I'm going to teach him to be the best damn prawn hunter this place has ever seen. You raise a good boy. What do you think you're going to name it? Red. Can't think of any better name. Thank you, my friend. Yeah, it's a strong name. Ah, uh, you be safe, my friend. That's really nice. So yeah, I don't think I had to do that. It was just really nice. Hanging Nexus is back here, past the train tracks. really pleasant place, very tropical. Oh, this bridge looks straight out of mist. The swaying bridge is chained together with rusted metal hoops. Come on, the bridge is safe. This could be the site for a village gathering, or a religious ceremony. Reclaimed nature, it's a zone. Well, before we go there then. Don't like heights, Marky. Yeah, that's a long way down. Oh my god. So it looks like we might be able to go in here. Where does this go? A, a curved metal walkway. Bridge constructed of wrought iron and wooden planks leads to the hanging nexus. Frayed ropes hold the nexus precariously in place. I'm starting to understand why it's called the hanging nexus, because it seems to literally be hanging. He's still active. An alien-looking structure of black metal suspended by ropes and vines. Nexus system is offline. Guardian not responding. Enable. Ooh, I hope it doesn't move. Nexus system is offline. Still? Uh, well, sounds like it's not gonna work, but... Nah. Nah. It's got green coming from it. Like I can do, do something. Do what?
Maybe we should go to the Reclaim Nature Zone and see if there's something there. Oh! Oh! Must have been a while since you were last activated. What's the last thing you remember? The only one, the builders. They started up the warp network. I waited for them to return to me. I waited through the rain and fire and the storms and dust that shred the metal from my very home. And when I could wait no longer, I descended into darkness. Oh, I've heard some speak about the Mubani. Who are they? They were creators. They built the wardens. They were looking peaceful and benevolent. If we are no longer here, then this world is an emptier place. I will warn them. They deserve better than to vanish. But it seems that their work goes on. And you, human, what do you want with me? I need access to the Warden Network. You humans are all the same. You create as I was taught. You destroy as I was warned. You expect those you leave behind to forget what you have done to them. I witnessed what your kind did to the athletes. How you programmed them to slaughter and hate their own brethren. It wasn't me. It wasn't us. You say that. Yet you want my servitude. Not servitude, no. I'm asking for your help. What is that that you want? I need to access the city of Bars. I know there's a warden there, but it isn't accessible anymore. My second processor is damaged. Without it, I cannot access the warden network. It is the one technology, specific to warden guardians. Without one, the warden network remains on top. I'm sorry you came all this way for nothing. I don't think I did come all this way for nothing. That must be what the Nexus CPU is for. I found another Guardian. It, uh, it wasn't using its processor. If we want the next discarding died, the warning would last for days. Pirates would be lit. Offerings would be made. And now we are nothing but scrap to be pillaged and then cobbled together. This was the young guardian. Its mind still forming. It had not travelled far. Not yet met the wardens. I'm sorry to hear it was so young. But now it has a second chance to live through you. Yes, that is true. But without an action map by Cameron to pass Horton. If you can tell me the coordinates to pass, I can attempt to allow you a link. Where do I find the coordinates? Well, we already have it, so I think we can skip this. Where could I find this go Oh, I don't give the coordinates to them directly. I guess I go to the console now. Uh -uh. Input new warden coordinates. I think that worked. I think I need to select it or anything. I think it's just done. Why is this still glowing green though? Like I can do something. And why do I sell the coordinates in my inventory? Hmm. The has been disseminated across the I have enabled 
access at the new end point. No, leave me to pain for the new one. My friends. Now let's go check out Reclaimed Nature. What are you looking at? Gorgeous plants here. The radiant colors of the plants contrast sharply against the white rocks. <clears throat> Just yesterday, this was a city. An ornate gold carving, a relic of a once great civilization. Sunlight filters through the acacia's delicate leaves. A heck of a view, huh? A craggy rock juts from the foliage like a bare bone from a dead pelt. Strange, vivid aloes bloom like flames in the veld. It's so peaceful here, so quiet. Mist rises from the dead city below. This whole city from there. So we have a new zone. The last one, well, hmm, there's one up here, although it's missing the button. <laughs> I don't know, maybe we can fix it if we get another zone. Drawn. Oh. Just the look of this place from here looks really interesting. What is that red? Is it doesn't seem to be like lava kind of stuff. I don't know what it is. Whoa. It's just a red mist over the whole place. Dead city of Boss. God, it's got such an eerie look to it. Look at these shapes in the ground. It's geometric patterns. I'm gonna get new music for the new zone, heck yeah. Okay, I think I'm going to end the episode here, though. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, we are going to explore Charon, the dead city of Boss.